incredible, and huge oil tankers transport large quantities oil of about 2 billion metric tons across oceans straight to refinery sites. Here are the 10 largest oil tankers in the world. 10. Berga Empress In 1976, the Berga Empress was built in Chiba, Japan. Its length was 381.82 meters, 1,252.7 feet, gross weight was 211,358 tons, and dead weight was 423,745 tons. The oil tanker was owned by Bergeson D.Y. and Company and operated for a considerable period of time. It was one of the largest oil tankers ever built at the time due to its enormous length. She survived longer than many of the other oil tankers on this list. But for many of the same reasons, the Berga Empress was finally sent out to be destroyed. In contrast to some other exceptionally huge oil tankers, it did live for about 30 years. She ultimately passed away around 2004. 9. Beijing Spirit It was constructed in 2010 at Jiangsu Rongsheng Heavy Industries Shipyard in China. It is 156,000 tons of cargo capacity, is 900 feet long, and 157 feet wide. It is 83,000 tons in weight. Its top speed is 15 knots, and its engines have a total output of 25,000 horsepower. This ship is operated by Tiki Marine Singapore, a company founded in 1973. With 130 vessels that transport liquid fuels or liquefied natural gas, this company manages the largest fleet of medium-sized tankers. 8. TI Europe TI Europe is the third of the four TI-class supertankers, built by Diwu Shipbuilding and Marine Engineering. The length of this vessel, which was being operated by Tankers International, was 380 meters, 1,247 feet. In contrast to TI Asia and TI Africa, TI Europe was not used as an FSO. Before being bought from Euronav NV and its partners, the ship was known as Hellespont Terra. TI Europe travels at a pace that is equivalent to other oil tankers with comparable specifications. This is one of the elements raising the likelihood of bigger earnings. 7. Esso Pacific The Esso Pacific was the Esso Atlantic sister ship. It measured 406.57 m, the same as the former Esso tankers incorporated ships, 1,339 feet. Esso Pacific was one of the seven ships with that feature and, like her sister ship, had a deadweight capacity of more than 500,000 tons. Similar in size to the Suez Canal and the Panama Canal, this massive oil ship found it challenging to travel through all three of them. It was in operation for the same period as Esso Atlantic, from 1977 to 2002. 6. TI Asia the TI Supertanker class includes the Supertanker TI Asia, sometimes referred to as FSO Asia since 2009. The prefix TI in the name indicates that Tankers International is the owner and operator. The FSO in its present designation refers to its eventual conversion into a floating storage and offloading vessel. The TI Asia is 1,247 feet long overall and has a gross tonnage of 234,006 and a deadweight tonnage of 234,006, like the other three ships of this class. TI Asia was built by Diwoo Shipbuilding and Marine Engineering in South Korea and launched in 2002. 5. Sea Emerald The ship was built in 2019 at Diwoo Shipbuilding in South Korea. It is 1,102 feet in length, 196 feet in width, and weighs 156,000 tons. Its 120,000 cubic yard gasoline tank has a 300,000 ton carrying capacity. Its engines can propel the ship at a top speed of 17 knots and produce a combined 44,000 horsepower. The shipping company, Pantheon Tankers, has boosted its capability for international transport with the introduction of this tanker 
and will shortly introduce additional ships of the same size. 4. The Bellamaya Bellamaya, the biggest of the two ships, and the sister ship of Pierre Guillemat and Prairial, measures 414.22 meters, 1,359.0 feet, in length. It weighs 247,267 tons grossly, and 553,662 tons in dead weight. Bellamaya was a corporation that was in operation from 1976 to 1986. During a period of declining oil prices, Chantiers de l'Atlantique built the ship for Shell Oil's French operations. The ship size also rendered it unable to function in a number of essential areas. The only supertanker larger than it in the Batilis class was the Seawise Giant. When Bellamaya was laid up in Norway in 1984, its active duty was over. 3. Andaman Oil Tanker It was built in 2016 at the Hyundai Heavy Industries shipyard in South Korea. It is 154,000 tons in weight, 1,092 feet in length by 196 feet broad, and has a weight capacity of 299,000 tons. Its engines enable it to reach a top speed of 14 knots and 32,000 horsepower. Since 2016, the Euronav firm has been employing this tanker to deliver vast volumes of oil to numerous countries, with ports in Asia and Europe functioning as the discharging locations. Six years after its construction in 2016, Andaman is currently sailing the seas off the coast of Liberia. 2. HMM Universal Leader It was constructed in 2019 under the flag of Panama at the Diwu Shipbuilding Shipyard in South Korea. It is 196 feet wide, 1,102 feet long, and 156,000 tons heavy. It features a fuel tank with a 123,000 cubic yard capacity and a 300,000 ton cargo carrying capacity. Her engine can reach a top speed of 14 knots and produce a combined 32,800 horsepower. Scrubber systems are installed on vessels, in compliance with IMO environmental rules and ship engines, to ensure the most fuel-efficient speed. 1. Seawise Giant The largest oil tanker ever constructed was the Seawise Giant. It was the longest self-propelled ship ever constructed at the time. Although it was once known as Seawise Giant, it has also been called Happy Giant, Jar Viking, Knock Nevis, and Montana. This ship measured 458.46 meters in length, 1,505.1 feet. It had a gross tonnage of 260,851, a dead weight of 564,763, and a carrying capacity of 657,019 tons. The Seawise Giant was formerly owned by Preati Shipping and was constructed in Kanagawa, Japan, by Sumitomo Heavy Industries. During the 1988 Iran-Iraq War, explosives sank the Seawise Giant. This brings us to the end of today's video. Please comment below on what machine I should make a video on next. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and also click to watch our full vehicle playlist.